Today we're going to show you the Tesla new Model S Plaid review. This Tesla Model S Plaid is the newest, highest, and most interesting thing that the Electromaker has made. Elon Musk said that the Tesla Model S Plaid features have some of the most advanced innovations on this planet. Now you might be wondering, what secret technology was he referring to? Let's explore the most interesting technical highlights of this vehicle. Tesla has always been leading in the automobile industry as it is highly pushing boundaries to create something serious by shifting industry moves. This Tesla Model S Plaid is the result of an electric company that delivers the performance of Tesla to ridiculous levels. CEO Elon Musk often says that Tesla cannot die. He said, Tesla is incredibly important for sustaining the future industry of transport and energy. The main feature that Tesla provides is its acceleration power, which is a reason for the survival of transport and energy generation. 2022 new Tesla Model S Plaid is a Frankenstein creation of the 0-60 to 60 EV arms race. Half grocery sedan, half million dollar supercar. It's a quiet, beeping robot and smooth while running on the road. When you step into the car, a hyper cockpit is gonna make you feel like you entered some new automotive paradigm that totally changes your perception of space and time. As Tesla CEO Elon Musk said, so basically, our vehicle plan is stolen from Spaceballs. When unveiling the 1020 horsepower Model S Plaid, he was referring to the parody film of the original Star Wars and was released in 1987. In that movie, the fastest speed of light is called a ludicrous speed. When the spaceship reached that speed, it appeared like a Plaid, leading a character to remark it in wide-eyed awe. They have gone to Plaid. It's the first vehicle of the Tesla company that is powered by three motors, one at the front axle and the other two at the rear. All of them are permanent magnet synchronous AC machines. This Plaid model also has a carbon fiber sleeved motor, which seems to be a spinning part of the motor. This carbon fiber cover holds all rotors together to enable the rotational speeds up to 20,000 RPM, which is almost 25% faster than ever before. It is hard to make a motor that spins fastest without overheating or blowing apart. Tesla says that the copper wire is wounded at extremely high tension, which results in a very efficient electromagnetic field. Tesla Model S Plaid has an insanely swift and the most responsive powertrain, with an impressive range for daily use. What is the fastest car you have ever been in so far? So, this car is running for about 9.5 seconds. When you sit in the cockpit of a Model S Plaid, you're gonna first select the drag strip mode. This unlocks the maximum acceleration, which results in heating the battery to the optimum temperature. Now mash and hold the accelerator and brake pedal for about 10 seconds to signal the air springs of the vehicle to lower the front end. This allows the front tires to tuck into the fenders. This is what Tesla calls the cheetah stance, which is just 0.1 seconds slower to 60 miles per hour and through the quarter mile. The initial launch hit is not the gut punch as the power ramps injudiciously to maintain traction. After the 2.1 second flash, the shocking bit of plate gonna hit 60 miles per hour, which results in it accelerating so quickly. The V-Box test equipment has recorded the speed of 4.3 seconds to 100 miles per hour and a quarter mile in 9.4 seconds. This resembles the speed of the Bugatti Chiron sports car, of which the quickest quarter has been recorded. If you are using a Tesla, you might know better that after one or two acceleration runs on a full charge, this turns off the performance tapers quickly. No longer. The Tesla Model S Plaid's radiator is twice as large as before. The test car ran eight consecutive consistent passes, the last one at an average of 80% state of charge. The Plaid vehicles do not draw any adulation or envious looks on the road. All their secrets are hidden beneath an old sheet metal. The Model S Plaid actually blew the quickest exotic away in a passing test, where it ran from 30 to 50 miles per hour in 0.9 seconds, and from 50 to 70 miles per hour in 1 second. Those are the super quickest times that test gears have ever witnessed. Their speed was twice as quick as the Chiron. About a 30% improvement was observed from the previous Model S performance and the Porsche Taycan Turbo S. The Tesla Model S Plaid also addresses the EV shortcomings, which results in the power shutting down dramatically with the velocity of speed. The Electromobile company claims that the Plaid continues to produce 1,000 of its 1,020 horsepower all the way. This gives the car a very linear power band with its peak horsepower at 80 mph to its top speed of 200 mph. Despite this, the current speed is limited to 163 mph to keep things within reasonable limits. Now moving forward, Tesla Model S Plaid includes a new track mode as a part of the model's latest version. Track mode has the power to establish more efficiency in the performance of the vehicle. By allowing drivers to make adjustments for better distribution of power leads to a high level of performance on the circuit. In this case, the track mode gives the battery's heat pump thermal management system to boost for more effective cooling. 
This allows the power system to maintain maximum capacity for a longer period. CEO Elon Musk claims that Tesla's most powerful vehicle might not be the quickest to 60 miles per hour, but it has definitely broken records in testing performance of other vehicles in the automobile industry. The biggest drawback which you might have in a Tesla model is the yoke has no top rim, which makes it difficult to grab the steering perfectly at the beginning. Although it is easy to use when driving on the highway, it becomes a nightmare during parking or maneuvering a car in tight spaces. Even the location of the horn is not in the middle of the yoke, like in most of the cars, but is located at the top right corner. This also makes it quite frustrating because during normal use, we can't even find it in the first place. And even during sharp turns, we accidentally press the horn, which is quite embarrassing. Another awkward thing to be found in this model series is the control option selected from the menu. So if we want to select any drive mode, we have to separately view each of it. So it might be a good idea to have a separate controller in the car to put it in played mode. Even drag strip mode takes 10 minutes instead of a few seconds to enable the cheetah stance, as mentioned by the manufacturer is not correct. Another lie is about the speed range of the car, which is not correct as told about it. You will find it while driving this car that it does not pick up the speed mentioned to be around 348 to 390 miles depending on the mode of wheels we select. It roughly gets the highest speed averaging between 150 to 170 miles. Even if we are driving in played mode, it doesn't pick the speed range mentioned by the manufacturer. Finally, the last drawback which is seen in this model is the look of the Model S, which is not improved for each new launch series. Every other model looks similar to the previous series. Even the soon-to-be-launched model looks similar without any change in its look. So it means they haven't improved the look of the model for each series, which is indistinguishable from one another. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. In terms of acceleration, a starting price depending on its performance is $131,440. At the end of 2022, the UK is going to start delivering played models, which will cost around £118,980. The new Tesla Model S played is quite expensive, but still, it costs less than many rivals. So, what do you think? Is it worth purchasing a new Model S played? Can you drive it as a daily driver? What do you think? Is $130,000 a justifiable price tag for Model S played? While the long-range version is almost the same vehicle at a discount price of $35,000. Share your thoughts with us in the comment section below.